Opening three minutes of this 10-round fight. And the old one-two by Parker. Bad intentions, his defense is now serving him well. Nice job blocking that punch. Tried the hook, didn't get it. Bad intentions is impressing the judges and himself with that right hand. Big shot, blistering combination. Big shot, blistering combination. The speed of those punches just put him down. They got there quicker than his hands got back to... but able to get up to his feet. Teddy, what should he be thinking about now? Well, right now, just surviving, but if he survives, then he better figure out why he was put on the floor. Tucks those elbows in, blocks the body shot. As if the right hand wasn't enough. How about that accurate left hook he just landed to the midsection? Bad intentions, his punch is far off the target. He saw the uppercut, he took advantage, throwing it out there. Tensions is hurt by a superb hook to the head. And bang, and away he goes. After every round, what makes a great cut man? Well, he's going to have the right medicine, the right coagulants to stop that. Usually avatine, thrombin, adrenaline. But the most important thing, Joe, is he has to be calm. He has to be able to identify where that cut is. Maybe there's more than one cut. So you got to be calm enough to see the whole picture, the whole landscape, clean it off, put pressure on it. Get that medicine in there, keep your fighter from getting excited. And then you need a fighter who's going to get on his wheels a little bit. Give the medicine a chance. Bad intentions is crushed by a right hand. Wow! From absolute... I don't know that he's going to get the glory, but what guts to keep fighting here when he's damaged like this? Well, actually, Joe, too much guts. That's why the old-time guys, the smart trainers, you just say, you have to have a little fear in there to know when you're in a bad place, to know when to grab... Went to get out of there. Good right hand. Well oh, and there you go. Great. Oh, and he got caught right there. Everything was going fine, and then he got caught. Well, that's the problem. It was going too fine. He got a full sense of security. The other guy wasn't thrown back. He took for granted, and bang, you can't take for granted in this ring. Mendoza's hurt. Wow, is he hurt. He was the one doing the hurt just moments ago. Well, he's been reminded. Of big, big shot he just scored with. 